As for Deputy Smith, he was a 14 year law enforcement veteran. And his death is now being felt by so many in the small town of Mountain View and around Stone County. Our Gary Burton Jr. is live in Mountain View after a news conference was held with information on the case. Gary, I know you talked with people who knew the deputy personally, right? Absolutely. Extra information about the death of Stone County Deputy Justin Smith is still thin as it's being investigated by Arkansas State Police. But at today's press conference, I was able to get a deeper understanding of who Justin Smith was, not only as a member of law enforcement, but as a man. Everybody at this agency is heartbroken to have suffered a tragedy such as this. Nationwide, 123 law enforcement members were killed in the line of duty in 2023. The first in 2024, Stone County Deputy Justin Smith. It was never a time that he was called to come in that he didn't show up. Uh, he was the type of person that when his shift ended, if he needed to stay over, there was no question asked that he was going to do that. With tears in his eyes, Stone County Sheriff Brandon Long says, with or without the badge, Smith was a faithful servant and a great friend. Deputy Smith was a husband. He was a father. Um, he was just like any of us. It, it never really occurred to us um, that, um, that something like this could happen. Deputy Smith's oldest son, Ashley, says from the days he was a child, his dad always wanted to work in law enforcement. It took him a long time to get there. Uh, and he put a lot of work in. But he did it, and his family is so happy he was able to live his dream. And we're very proud that he got to that point, uh, that he was able to become a deputy. Um, he loved that job. He loved helping people in this county. Um, and so uh, we were very proud of him. And out of 14 years of service, it's no question that Justin Smith encountered with a number of people. And I actually met one of those people today at a local restaurant. That he worked there and he told me about a time that he was going through some troubling times, but it was Deputy Justin Smith that talked to him and helped him through. He told us that he will never, ever forget that day and he will always be grateful for Deputy Justin Smith. Reporting live in Mountain View, I'm Gary Byrne Jr., Fox 16 News.